Why did you decide not to have a, uh, a dedicated quarterback coach on your staff? Well, I, I want um, – here, here's the important thing. I think there needs to be um, – Mike and I need to stay on the same page as it gets to the quarterback. And so the first year – this is a little different than some of the other models in terms of staffing, but uh, Mike wants to be intimately involved coaching the quarterbacks. He's done a great job throughout his career, and uh, you know we have we have other guys that can help do the work. Does having Eli in that room make it easier? Yeah, I mean, anytime you have a veteran quarterback, it certainly makes it easier. Eli's uh, Eli's an outstanding player; has been for a very long time. Do you think there are franchise-changing players in this draft? I mean, I know I you're every, in the middle Every of draft has, you know, a generational player in the draft. And the key is to, uh, you know, highlight them and, and then pick them. How much work did you do on Davis Webb last year? I mean, and, and yeah. what, did you, what do you remember coming away with it? Yeah, I did, I did a lot of work on him, actually. Uh, we liked him a lot. He was in the quarterback discussion. You know, really, Quite frankly, behind the scenes, no matter what your quarterback room is like, we all do the quarterbacks every year. And so last year was no different, and we liked him a great deal. We thought, um, you know, he was a winner. We felt like, you know, he was. We liked his size. We liked his arm strength. Um, we liked his decision making. You know, he could move around in the pocket. And so I can see why the Giants drafted him a year ago. Because we liked him as well. Have you gotten positive feedback from the people, like the coaches say that you brought over from the last staff? Have you canvassed kind of the building on what they think of Davis yeah. Webb? And, you know, have you gotten any feedback in that sense? Yeah, I mean, that's probably a good way to phrase the question. I've canvassed the building, asking questions about a lot of different topics. Certainly one involving Davis, because there's not a lot of tape on him in an NFL, you know, an NFL game. But everybody thinks he's got a very bright future.